Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. In this video, we break down the concept of the reporting threshold limit for impurities in HPLC step by step. Let's start it. Impurities in HPLC. Impurities are the substance present in the small amount within the sample other than the main active compound. For example, in a pharmaceutical product, impurities could be present of the manufacturing process or degradation product over time. These impurities need to be detected and qualified to ensure the safety and quality of the product. What is reporting threshold? The reporting threshold is the minimum amount of an impurity thus must be reported in the analysis. It sets the limit below which any detected impurity is considered too low or insignificant to be reported. In this case, the reporting threshold for impurities is set 0.1%. What is the meaning of threshold of 0.1%? This means that if the amount of an impurity in the sample is less than 0.1%, of the total sample, it does not need to be reported in the analytical results. If the impurity exceeds 0.1% of the total sample, it must be included in the final report as it is considered significant. Now you have a question, why a threshold is set 0.1%? The threshold is important because not all impurities need to be reported. Very small amount impurities below 0.1% are often considered to have a no meaningful impact on quality product or safety. Setting a threshold helps to focus on an impurity that could pose a risk or affect the quality of the product. How it's no. applied in HPLC? When performing HPLC analysis, the instrument detects various peaks which include unknown or non impurities in the sample. After analysis, the percentage of each impurity is calculated. If the impurity is found to be 0.1% or higher, it is reported in the result. If it is below 0.1%, it can be omitted from the report as per the threshold guidelines. For example, this is aspirin tablet related substance graph. In this graph, we can see that aspirin impurity C and three unknown impurities have been detected. Now, you see the percentage area of the aspirin is 99.56% and impurity C is 0.23%. That is higher than 0.1% threshold limit. So, we have to count impurity C in the report. Other three unknown impurity percentage area is 0 0.09, 0 0.06 and 0.05% which below threshold limit. So we cannot count this and not reporting this impurities. I hope you enjoyed this video and learn something from it. See you I in the next video. Till then, goodbye. Thank you.